All right, just arrived at this rather posh uh, shopping mall, is it? In uh, Merida shopping mall. It's called, uh, I don't know, what's it called? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> anyway, it's a pretty posh place. We've just traveled like half hour in the taxi uh, from where we were staying because we've heard it's a metal mat, by the way. Metal mat and the banana. The espousa. Benita espousa. Yeah, tell them. Tell them why we're here today. Well, we saw and also people tell me like, it is the great and amazing cakes that you can. Cakes. Cakes and bread. Pastries and things. Um, yeah, so we're here because we heard it's the best. The best cakes in Merida. I mean, originally it was supposed to be the best cakes in Mexico, but then I think it's just the best cakes in Merida. But we'll see. Either way, uh, best cakes in Merida. Let's give it a shot. We've looked at some videos and it's amazing. I'm just uh, in awe at the moment at the roof. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? Yeah. Wow. We just got to find the place now. Do you know what this amazing cake shop's called? City Party Tours in City Party That's the mall. What about the cake shop? Um, exactly. You see it, do you? Right, we're on course, but uh, yeah, this is weird. I don't know if it's mainly uh, locals or tourists that are coming here, but it's hard to tell, really. I assume it's a local place, local mall. My allergies have been playing up there. Um, and I've had a lot of uh, too much uh, margaritas today, so I'm a bit. <laughs> well, no, I had a bit more than that. But, yeah, not too many, but I'm a lightweight. <laughs> too many for me, it was about. Three and a half, three and a half, four, and uh, too much. They were strong, I think he was put a lot of tequila in. I don't usually feel anything, feel like I'd like five. <laughs> At this time, three to four was too many. Oh, is this the place? We're here. I was expecting like an indoors place. Yeah. Okay. Wow. What are these then? These are just like chocolates. Caramel, salty caramel. Oh, oh, that's oh English. Yeah, we've got to try some of these. Ask how much they are. Quanta question. 35 pesos. 35 pesos? One oh, pound. we'll do that. Which one's salted caramel? That blue one. Oh, yeah. yeah, I've got to try the salted caramel, but this is. Buy one I'm real excited. <laughs> yeah, one of each. One of each. One of each. Wow, yeah, this is the one we were seeing on video. Looks amazing. I think these are definitely the best cakes in Merida, if not Mexico. Because uh, I've never seen anything like this. These pastries are a bit more traditional Mexican things I've seen. Things like that. But um, they still look really unique and really good. Wow. Uh, what should we do? Just get a few things? Yeah. Tuck in. Might as well just order. We could get a croissant. <laughs> pan of chocolate. Yeah, 70 pesos. That's five pounds, the equivalent. If it's 100 pesos, you know that's like five five English pounds. Zinco. Ice cream. Ice cream. I'm just really tempted by these. Pistachio looks amazing. That looks amazing. Ah, oh, but they're nearly 10 pounds. 160. Yeah. I'm definitely gonna try the orange, but that also looks amazing. Oh, what should we do? I want those two, I gotta be honest. What ones are you catching your eye? That also looks, yeah. This one, maybe this one, pistachio. Yeah. I think with pistachio, it is lovely, but I don't know. Oh, this one. If it's gonna be the best. that blue in the middle which one would you pick guys if you were gonna would you pick the uh, black forest the no no and 
Ranger, no Ranger. Orange. Frozen Sun Diamond. From Busa. This one or this one? No. Which you prefer? This nice. one or this one? Exotica or Russia. Which one would you go for, guys? Um, which one are you after? The Russia. I'd go for that one. Yeah, but okay. chocolate is lovely, but, but we wanna buy we're going to buy. Chocolate. But we've got to get the orange this as well. One, this one, this one. Yeah, all right. Um, <laughs> yeah, one. those two and that one. But I've got to try this caramel. These sweets. Ah, they got pistachio chocolate if you want to try pistachio something. I'm not fussed about the pastry, but if you want to get some. I love croissants and stuff, mm. but I'm not crazy about any, any other pastries too much. Yeah, red velvet looks great. Mm -hmm. I think I've tried something similar to that. I don't know where, but... That looks good to me. When you there's ham, ham, yeah, it could be Preco, I don't eat Preco. Just Preco. Yeah, this is great. So this place is Maybe called what? Fred What's the name of it? Oh. That's the... Cafe in Merida, that's where we are today. That looks lush as well. So we're going to get a few things because we're only here once. At the moment, <laughs> we'll come back again one day, probably, but not for a long time. Got to try salted caramel, that's my favorite, favorite flavor always for chocolate. Oreo, I don't get all the buzz about Oreo. Oreo, uh, pistachio, and salted caramel are the ones I like. Oreo, I don't care about. Passion fruit is probably nice. Tell you what. You get a few passion fruit, salt of caramel, pistachio, toffee one looks lovely, toffee bear. I'm gonna start this already. Which one do you want then? Uh, um, yeah? Uno, uno uh, caramelo, uh, salado. salado, uh, uno toffee baileys, uno pistachio, uno, uh, Maracaya. Maracuya. Kaya. And uh, whatever you want, my love. Do you want to get some chocolates no, as well? Do you want some? Bueno, quiero una de. Una de esas de mango pasión. Y una de pralín. Y de aquí él quiere un black forest. Oh, no. Uno de. Naranja. Uno de naranja. On uh, tarta exotica. Tarta exotica, see. Sí. Y un croissant de fruta. Red velvet. Red velvet. Por favor. Y un agua. Drinks. Just sí. a coffee. Uh, Latte. Latte. Hmm. Uh, what are the options? Flat white. Yo quiero un chocolate caliente. Might get a. Uh, Grande, tu amor. Latte, I do the job. Mm, latte grande también. Perfect. So, uh, being a bit groovy, but that's the point when you have a little holiday. Uh, we, we live in Mexico, but uh, it's uh, a little trip for us at the moment, exploring some different places. Uh, it's a holiday within. Within a holiday, in a way, but uh, when you live somewhere, you don't see it as a holiday um, after a while. But this is like a fun little trip for us. Lots of tips as well, so it must be good. <laughs> It'll be so expensive, like 60 pounds. How much? 60. <laughs> really? Yeah. But I thought it was only 35 pesos of chocolate. It's like two pounds. <laughs> Don't use that car. I suppose we can, but... Wow. Don't... <laughs> Don't put the code in. Alright, that's me rinsed out. But it's been something we've been waiting to do. 
um, for a while, so pesos, but that is or 200 pesos is about 10 pounds. So 200, four. it is about 50 pounds. Yeah. Oh well, <laughs> I don't usually do that. It's got to be the most expensive cake shop ever. But uh, yeah, it does look amazing. Huh? Beautiful decor. You want to hear? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this is okay. I do need the band but I don't know. Mm. Band your that way. Keep filming for her. Oh, so. Most expensive cake shop ever, or is it the Shows best cake shop ever? In case they want to buy something, something. Yeah, we'll talk you through this. Cakes are about five pounds each. The chocolates are about uh, three pounds each. Um, yeah, some cakes are more expensive. 160, that's very expensive. Which cake was that? Is the naranja, orange. All the cakes are expensive. It's eight pounds each. Eight pounds each. Oh. Yeah. Good job I've had margaritas, but I don't think I would be paying that if I had them. <laughs> Nine, I did like 50 pounds. No. <laughs> figured it out already. I'm on top of it. Oh, uh, this is your Valentine's gift? No. No, oh, right. Oh, well, hopefully they won't take too long, because with these little vlogs, I can't be bothered editing stuff. I haven't got time for that. So I just keep it rolling in real time. And, uh, it's real. If I add it, you might get a false idea of things. So if you're seeing things as they are, as they're happening. Um, authentically. My videos generally don't go any longer than half hour for these vlogs. So uh, everything will be covered within the half hour. So sit back, get your nearest croissant or cake ready. And enjoy the video. Um, make a coffee. I'm having a latte. What are you having? Hot chocolate. Hot chocolate. Yeah. You can choose either hot chocolate or a latte. Sit back with a cake. Imagine you're in uh, Merida, Mexico, eating uh, with us. <laughs> but, uh, I'm not paying for you to, so uh, you'll have to chip in. Um, if you've got any ideas of places you want us to uh, go uh, while we're visiting all these different places, or if you want to see how much a certain restaurant is, or cakes or anything, you can donate to the channel. Um, because, uh, I'm a musician and different things, so I make money kind of here and there, you know. Um, but uh, if you want to support our travels and the, if there's anything you're particularly interested in and you can cater to that, give a donation, leave a comment, and you can send over PayPal or something. Leave a comment if you want to send us anything towards stuff, then we can buy some Mexican thing while we're in Mexico. I'm always in Mexico, so anything you want to see us try, street food, different things. Uh, just uh, yeah, make a donation and we'll, we'll mention you in the video too and uh, yeah, we can do all that personalised stuff because uh, yeah, and it makes our trip a bit more fun we can get some ideas from you guys and uh, yeah, any donations to the channel I always appreciate it because we're, uh, we're uh, travelling at the moment in our holidays and uh, trying to enjoy it the best we can we don't travel about extravagantly all the time usually just living in the downtown uh, and just uh, living a simple life but at the moment we're being a bit extravagant because it's holiday time but yeah um, yeah that's it really but yeah I feel like a 
send in a few quid I'll direct them, that'd be great. Uh, just uh, leave a comment. And, uh, I think it's paypal.me paypal.me slash uh, slash Matt Gothic. And that is the PayPal me link you can use to send us some money. Um, but if that doesn't work, just leave a comment and uh, we'll, we'll make sure. Well, I'll put it in the description. I'll let you know the PayPal link if you want to send a little donation. If you enjoy the content or if you want us to do anything. Or, uh, if you want some music related stuff, like uh, you want me to sing guest on one of your songs or something. Obviously, I'm a musician, singer, uh, first and foremost, so uh, these videos are just for fun, give you a little insight into our travels, uh, and you enjoyed the whole boss stuff, so I thought uh, I'll keep rolling. Um, but uh, yeah, you can book me for messages, video messages too, for birthdays and stuff on my uh, Cameo, Memo, Celeb VM, a few different websites. Uh, so yeah, that's how you can support me and the channel. And, uh, like I say, I'm always up for guesting on songs and stuff. Uh, just contact me and I'll let you know my prices. I can scream heavy metal stuff. I can do the mellow pop stuff. High notes like Judas Priest stuff or black metal, venom type, growls, cool growls, all that sort of growly black metal. Uh, anything really. I've, I've got a wide range of uh, musical uh, versatility, I guess, vocally. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, I'm only rambling on because we're waiting for the food and i got to talk about something, but I might as well talk about you guys supporting the channel, donating, because uh, yeah, it'd be great if you do, so uh, yeah, but yeah, give us a book if you want a birthday message, I'm always happy to do all that stuff for you or a friend or something, and uh, yeah, um, it's always good fun, that, so find me on all those websites that do all that stuff. Oh, anyway, it's taking ages. Enough rambling about that. It's gonna it be not like people running away and take ages. Yeah, I don't know either, but uh, let's have a little chat with Nirvana. So, tell me, Matt, of course. What cake? What cake is it you wanna <laughs> you wanna eat today? What's your favorite cake? I never try this cake. I will try your cakes too. Not my chocolate though, I want my uh, salted caramel. Oh. You can you can share the other ones, all the other ones are fine, but... I will share all the cakes. The cakes, yeah. Oh. The chocolate, I like my salted oh, caramel. Yeah, bite. I will have all the other ones, mm -hmm. but not the salted caramel. Every other one. I want a salted caramel. I'm selfish, I'm selfish with the salted caramel. Oh, I, I love that one. Although I need to remember which one it is, the green one, not the salted caramel. Why do you think so? Why? So, I said because I want a big box, but... A what? Box. Box? Yeah, and they will bring in a plate. Why did she say no box? I said I want a box. How do you know she ain't going to do a box? Because then? she's bringing... What? Because she's bringing the food. Yeah, but how do you know she ain't bringing it in a box, if that's what you asked for? Because I see. I oh, just saw it. <laughs> there we go. Beautiful. Much as grass here. Lovely. Chocolates are coming later, I'm guessing. I know, I love that. We'll go straight down the middle with all of these, yeah? Wow. Now I'm excited. This is great. I'm going to rest this. Hopefully I got something I can rest this camera on, so I don't want to be holding this anymore. So you should be able to see us now tucking in. And, uh, yeah, just join us, please, for a Okay. You watch the That's true. Yeah. Good thinking. Yeah. We're in there. Watch out behind you, boy. What's happening? Coffees. Mm. 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 Latte? 
I'm gonna guard, guard with my life. Um, so I love salt caramel too much. But all the others you can share, or well, you can have them. I'm not, not bothered about macaroons or whatever. Is that all the chocolates we got? Is it? Yeah. That looks great. That's like a horror film, like right um, Yeah, well, that's like blood splatter then. Yeah. Horror, like Alice Cooper star. Chop, chop, chop. Sure you can take this off Pretty sure, yeah. Um, yeah, I'll check. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm in there. See? We can have a look. Just have, just have a look. No, leave it. Just make sure I'm in there. Just have a look around. But I don't think it's an issue. Right. But you're in there, I know that. We want to, don't move it there. We've got to both be both be in it. I don't want just me in it. Right. Anyway, we're going to try the first uh, I love this. It's like a little uh, fairy tale. Which one do you want after? This one's like a fairy tale. A little mushroom thing. Toadstool on top of it. <laughs> you can imagine it in Shrek. Not worried about the croissant too much if you want to try it. The orange is the one I've been waiting to try, so. Uh, yeah. You ready? You take the first. I'm going to put some sugar. Cane sugar, raw cane sugar, that's the good stuff. And the coffee, my latte. chocolate orange so far. Let's try it. So yeah. It's a mousse. It's a mousse. Oh lovely. Got like a uh, mm, yummy. That is large. The chocolate on the outside is lovely like chocolate orange kind of taste. Remember the, the, when we in Bristol, like the chocolate uh, orange that you're yeah, doing like this? Yeah, that's the what table? I'm saying, yeah. It's exactly the same and it kind of taste. The mousse though, I, I need to give this another try. Cheese, no? Lovely, yeah. Um, yeah, a bit of a queso cheese vibe. There's a little <laughs> center, yeah. What's that then? Is that some real jelly, orange jelly or something? That looks lovely. It's orange. Is that? Yeah, I need to try that. Give that a go. Yeah. What we do, we just take a quick taste of each one. So this video ain't going on too long. And then we enjoy it after. <laughs> Why is it? Tarta exotica. Yeah, that's that exotica. Yeah, I can't wait to tuck into that middle bit. You can have the flower if you yeah. want. <laughs> Tuck it 
tough, is it? I'm just after some of that in the center. Lovely. Mm. This is guava. What is it? Guava. Guava. So, try a bit of that. Yeah, there's passion fruit there in the middle. What is that? Oh my god. What is that? What's going on, That is lovely. Right there. Really nice. Uh, Thank you. Really nice. I haven't tried this bit yet, but it tastes like passion fruit in the middle, but you're denying it. It's a candy from Mexico, Yucatan. It's like I think I've had it, but I can't picture it. That is amazing. This bit. The actual uh, cake itself. I don't know what that is. Just cream and it's like a mousse again, isn't it? Like a kind of mousse. I found it. Take that for some. Oh, you got your flour. Mm. How is it? How's the mm. flour? Oh no, I never know. Mm. I'll go to my grave not knowing how that flour is. I doubt we'll get that again. <laughs> oh, it's got a crumb. That is large. Right, on to the final cake. Because I don't want this video going on too long. We're nearly at the half hour mark now. You right holding that a minute just while I uh, cut into it? I don't know where my spoons went, but we'll go for a fresh one. As you had your, your flour, I'm going to eat bit of the, <laughs> the toadstool. Right. Very nice, that's like a crafty chocolate. Lovely. And like a cream, cream center. As for the tart itself, uh, wow. That's like those things you used to get. Pringles, chocolate Pringle <laughs> things. Oh wow, look at that. It's a berry center. I love stuff like this. I think this would be my favorite. Before I've even tried it, I'll get a nice bit of that center. We've got some chocolate as well. That's my kind of thing. I love those flavors. Oh, it's fresh, right? It's, uh, it's berry. It's, it's got a sharp. I think it's not just Fred's, it's probably like raspberry. Or it might just be raspberry. Delicious, really nice. Uh, yeah, lovely. A nice texture you got. Just crack your way through it. So far, which has been your favourite? Which one? Mm. I think. Yeah, I'm gonna go with this one. Ten out of ten. Do you want to try your croissant? You know, it tastes like bubble What is it? bubble lobo. What's bubble lobo? It's like a Mexican dessert. Like. Mm, I don't know how to explain. What's it it's called? It's like the flavor. What's it called? bubble <laughs> What? <laughs> what is it? bubble oh, that's, that's normal. bubble lobo. Right, I haven't heard of that one. Right, let's see if this camera stays for the final part, the croissant. Hopefully you can see us. Yeah, just break it, do it French style. See if the coffee's any good as well. Wow. <laughs> God, look at that. It's crazy. Right, let me just snap it for you. Difficult. I'll have the big bits now. I'll go for the maxi. <laughs> that was crazy. Look at that. So, it's insane. Yeah, the flavors are just crazy. The combination you got. The cream cheese, right? Yeah, I think there's cream cheese. Is, uh, is that passion fruit? Is it guava? <laughs> it's 
Guava, yeah, really nice. It's basically nice like passion a fruit. cream passion fruit. This is passion fruit. And a lovely red croissant. I mean, insane, you know. Um, I'm just going to finish this by eating uh, a little bit of these chocolates. So the salted caramel is this one. So I'm going to give that a go. What is that? Sort of caramel. Not too impressed. <laughs> it's okay. I don't know what it is. Sort of caramel. What? Where is this? Only chocolate? Chocolate, yeah. Mm. Nah. Mm. Not great. I think we'll save the chocolates for our own enjoyment because uh, otherwise we won't be able to enjoy this properly. But uh, there we go, salted caramel, not so good, but the cakes, um, amazing, um, as you can see. <laughs> this one, my favorite. Yeah, it is great, actually. I love this, and the little toad store that goes with it. Um, yeah, how's your hot chocolate? Is it good? <laughs> amazing. Yeah. Amazing. Yeah, my lap is pretty decent, so there you go. This is uh what's this place called? <laughs> the actual cake shop on here. Bachu Cafe in in what was it? City 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 Thirty Two uh <coughs> Mile in Merida. Yucatan, Mexico. Indian there might be an Indian restaurant. Yeah, we love our we Indian restaurants. <laughs> <laughs> we do. We love curry. Butter chicken. But I don't like too much chicken. I like like cheese. Sauce. Yeah, she likes the cheese, like the square cubes with the curry. In. I'm going for the butter chicken. Sometimes the hot ones, but uh, I find the, the milder ones often have more flavour, you know. But anyway, there you go, enough about food today. We got the cakes to talk about for now, and we're done with that. But, um, yeah, it's worth a visit, definitely. And maybe don't spend £50, get one or two cakes for yourself to try. We just, yeah, exactly, we've showed you which ones. So, yeah, again, if you appreciate our... Uh, generosity to show you <laughs> each cake and describe it for you and send us uh, a little da donation over paper uh, links in the description and uh, we're making a lot more of these videos just to show you guys whether it's worth visiting all these places around Yucatan and Mexico in general we're always traveling so you know when we get a chance uh, at the moment it's all Yucatan so we're uh, we'll probably be going uh, to uh, some islands next, Cozumel is in the Harris. So we'll tell you how good they are. Um, and uh, maybe stop off in Valladolid on the way. And some other little towns and things. Uh, there's El Coyo, we got that to show you. Um, there's a Chiquila, there's loads of different places we visited. And we'll, we'll show you if, uh, if it's good or not. It's all coming to the channel, so. If you want to see whether it's good places to visit, you'll, you'll see it soon. <laughs> but yeah, adios amigos, hope you enjoyed. And uh, yeah, we sure did. Bye. Bye. <laughs> adios amigos. Met on that end. Yeah, <laughs> hand me. <laughs>